Here we got some things out in front of the shop. A nice set of CA Lund snowshoes. They measure about 58 inches high, long, and about 12 inches across. Uh, they date about 1950, and they're likely a U.S. Army issue. They're a nice little set. Price we got on them is 149, which compares uh, pretty good to what you'll find online. You'll see them selling. Uh, for around $200, 200 plus, so uh, nice little item for your cabin wall. Here we see some of the other items we have out in front of the store. Uh, an old Canadian butter box from Alberta, it's a $30 item. Scan along, it looks like a $30 copper boiler. Enamelware. Here we have a nice little sled for the cabin wall. We've got a price down to 59 but if you were to come into the store and say, uh, offer me 49 I think we might have a deal. Same for the little Greyhound wagon there. It's a nice little one, really clean shape, uh, pretty solid. Uh, offer me 49 you can take it home. Here you have a real nice uh, Franklin Terrestrial Globe uh, produced by Nims and Knight, dating about 1889. You don't often find them this age, and uh, this one here we've got priced at $1,500, which if you uh, do a Google search is a really good price on these little globes, you know, it's, uh, you don't find them this old that often. There we go. I'm gonna come in and have a look at this one. Another nice little vintage piece we have here is a cabinet out of a barber shop advertising wild root hair tonic. Uh, it's a nice clean little one, painted white. See the decals are all in pretty good shape on it, so come on in and have a look. $149 is what we're asking for it. Good little piece of Canadiana. So it's a memorabilia we have hanging on our walls here. You see some calendars, barometers, thermometers. There's a beautiful little crumb tray. Probably dates about 1920s. There's an inlay in the middle of it there. 1913 calendar. It's a really nice shape. If you're looking for mid-century modern, we've got this beautiful little lamp in. Uh, it's a teak bottom. Zoom in a bit here you can see that it's a, sort of a stylized goose or three geese uh, sort of forming the uprights with a teak base. Oriental motif on the shade. $175. Check them out online see what compares. Have to come in and check out our selection of radios. It's a nice little cabinet. The radio's not working in it, but it's a nice little project for somebody. I'm sure it can be repurposed to some nice little use. Right beside it, we've got a 1930s floor model GE. It is a working radio, complete. Cabinet needs a little work. We're asking $125. Here we see some more of the radios in our collection. Uh, and see a nice little 58 Motorola tube radio. Some transistors coming up. See some more transistors. Sony transistor from the late 50s, 1958 I believe. One of the first transistors produced. Gives you an idea of what sort of things you can find here. Cameras is something we're always on the lookout for vintage pieces and good looking more contemporary. Uh, we got a couple Polaroids in some 8mm eight, eight movie cameras from the 50s. And prices are all reasonable. Looking for good affordable fishing equipment you'll have to check us out. We have rods, reels, here's some of the reels. Let's step over a bit here see some of the tackle that we carry. Zoom in a bit so you can see. Good. Hoochies, apexes, flashers, flies. Doesn't matter what you're looking for, good chance you're gonna find it here. Prices are about 
half or better of what you're going to be paying in uh, sporting goods stores. So be sure to check this out. If you're looking for vinyl, we do have a bit of a selection here. We tend to concentrate on rock and roll, 60s, 70s, 80s. You'll find some country in here, some jazz. Oh, there's a classic. Homer and Jethro at the Country Club. There you go, folks. Yeah, come on in and flip through and see if there's anything that catches your eyes. These are some of our little smalls cases. Just have a little bit of a scan here. You can see, it's a real mishmash of this, that, some of the other things. The memorabilia. Collectibles. Just general old stuff. If you're looking piece for pieces for your china set, we have a nice little Royal Albert set in. Just received it in. It's American Beauty, I believe. Pieces are all priced individually. Dinner plates, you're looking at about $17.99. Teapot, you're looking at $65. It's all in excellent condition. It doesn't look like it's been used. Just scanning up now, you can see we do carry other bits and pieces of china. There's a silver maple Royal Albert teapot, a large one. Teacups, more teacups and saucers. Ooh, kitchen stuff, old tins. Carry DVDs and CDs. DVDs and CDs are all $2.99 each. Got a fair selection of them. Come on in, have a look. And this is some of the odds and sods that we have hanging around in our cases china, figurines, silver plate. We'll just scan through, give you a taste of what you'll find at Thriftopolis. Vintage toys, a lot of Hot Wheels, Matchbox, Dinky. A couple of nice Coke trays down there. Then we get into our jewelry. Silver. We have several pieces of Moorcroft. A fan vase at the back is Malian Ware, dates about 1930. And we can see some of the jewelry in our case. Here we're looking at a tray of Sherman and other uh, brands of uh, vintage rhinestone jewelry. Silver rings. There you go. That gives you a little bit of an idea of what we've got in for this week.